Hey guys, Umoto Lifestyle here. Welcome to my YouTube channel and thank you so much guys for clicking. Thank you so much for always coming here to watch my videos. Guys, I'm coming to you from my backyard here, my swing set. For those ones who watch my videos, you know this swing set. I usually come here, enjoy sitting in my backyard and when the weather is so cool and I enjoy eating apples. That's my favorite snack, okay? <laughs> so guys, today's video, it's basically to give a shout out to the most deserving lady who is a YouTuber. Her name is Di Mwango. Guys, Di Mwango is this amazing young lady. She's from Africa, Kenya. She comes from the same country that I come from. And uh, she comes from the, one of the villages that's called Nyabohanze. Nyabohanze village is in the, um, between the border of Kenya and Tanzania. That's where you find that village. This girl, she is a YouTuber. She's a world traveled YouTuber. This girl was introduced uh, to YouTube by his brother. His brother is a world traveled brother. He has traveled over 70 countries. I've done a video, a couple of videos about this guy. His name is Aya Marwa. Guys, thank you so much for those ones who watched Aya Marwa and uh, recommending him. Is a very, very hardworking guy who has, who does only actually YouTube. This guy introduced uh, a brother, uh, a sister, Dimwango. Of course, he has a young brother, but today I'm talking about a sister. So he introduced her sister to uh, a YouTube when her sister finished uh, studying her university studies. She's a teacher by the profession, but she is a full time YouTuber <laughs> now. Actually, this girl. I love her. She is a hard working girl you can ever meet. This guy, she took this YouTube uh, thing that Ayamara, his brother, who calls himself a traveling commando, introduced her to do this YouTube thing. This girl has been able to travel most of the countries, I don't know, over 40 countries. And she's still traveling, but she is a go-getter. She is a hard working girl. So why I'm recommending this girl, I was amazed. Guys, I was so happy, like a girl, actually having children. People say that having a girl is a blessing, but I say having children is a blessing because his brother has been able to do amazing things as well. He has been able to build a villa. A villa is a huge mansionette house in the middle of the jungle of uh, the border of Tanzania, which is in Yabohansi, guys. I'm gonna pin the link of those, uh, both of them, Adimuango and Ayamaro here, so that you can go and watch them and see by yourself why I'm talking about these people and why I'm talking about this family. <laughs> So I'm saying this because you know most people have negative feelings that people who do YouTube they don't have nothing to do. Guys you can do YouTube as a full time if you really really want to travel or you want to say ah, I'm going to spend my whole time con uh, creating content, very interesting content, educative uh, content, content that's going to motivate people you know sharing people's stories you can be a full-time youtube uh, content creator so this family has taken this youtube to the next level this ayamara introduced to their uh, sister who is a dimwango and her mother she calls herself congrats mom in youtube guys i'm gonna pin the link for her as well so that you can check them out they have even a younger brother his name is david jr they all a family of uh, a YouTube simply because his brother, uh, the, the elder brother who's Ayamara, introduced the entire family to the uh, YouTube, uh, you know, world. So this Dimwango has been traveling all over the world. She uh, recently, she has been uh, traveling to Jamaica, guys. So, you know, Jamaica is the land we all love, okay? <laughs> Jamaica is amazing. I myself have not been to Jamaica, but that's my dream to be in Jamaica. Even though I live in the US, I want to go to Jamaica, okay? <laughs> I have a couple friends there in Jamaica that I want to go visit and I want to go uh, there to travel our people. <laughs> <laughs> so this girl has been in Jamaica for a couple, literally over eight, I don't know, eight or nine months actually. And she recently, I've been watching her videos a lot. I follow her a lot. I like the way she does her thing. She's so authentic. She, uh, her videos are so powerful. She's very careful when she puts her videos out there. 
you know, she is a go-getter girl. Her hard working ethics, you know, amazes me. I'm like, this is an African queen who worked so hard. And when I see people talking bad about a hard working girl, young girl working so hard, I get, I get, I get like, we have people's mind. Can't we cheer for this girl? Keep going. You know, the bad thing about our people is like when we see someone succeed, when we see somebody, guys, airplanes, <laughs> oh, they always go by or, or around my roof here. I don't know if you can hear me, but it's so loud. And I don't know if you can see me, guys. <laughs> I'm sitting here. Hey, it's me. It's authentic. It's a water lifestyle. Okay, I love to talk. <laughs> <laughs> and I love to say good things and I, I love, love, love to give credit where credit it deserves to be given. Like now, I'm giving credits to D Mwango. I'm gonna pin her link here, guys, if you don't know. She's a young girl from Africa, Kenya, in the village called Nyabo Anse. Nyabo Anse is the middle of, Taz uh, in between the border of Tanzania and Kenya. That's where this girl come from. And um, why I'm making this video is because the guy, this lady, this lady, this little girl, she in, uh, bought her mother a brand new BMW car. Oh my goodness, for her Valentine Day. Can you believe what YouTube can do? People say, oh, YouTube, YouTube doesn't pay. YouTube is just people wasting time. This girl, D. Mwango, she bought a car her mother who is a teacher i think she's a head teacher in one of the um, rural schools in nyabuanse you know but this girl uh, she managed to do youtube traveling all over the world and she has bought her mother a car from youtube money so i'm here to tell those haters or the, the non-believers of YouTube or the non-believers of, uh, of hard-working people, the enemy of progress. Oh my goodness. Go check that video out and you see by yourself. So Dimwango, uh, she had to flew from uh, Jamaica to come surprise her mother. Not only her mother, but she invited her family. A dad was there uh, and the sister was there and a brother. And she invited them to this fancy hotel, one of the hotels, big hotels, a five-star hotels in Nairobi. And she was be able to, you know, book their rooms there. They had lunch and dinner and breakfast, everything. Everything is sorted for her. So they sorted for them. I mean, I was watching these videos and I was like, oh my goodness, this girl, she is a go-getter. I was just cheering her and I was saying, oh my goodness, D. Mwango, made the almighty keep blessing you so that you can bless the rest you can make your mother your father your entire family happy your family is a hard working family your brother or your mother oh my goodness let god continue blessing him more and more and keep adding to him more and more because now you see, because of your brother, you have been able to inspire so many. You have been able to surprise your mother. Your mother didn't see this car coming, but she was crying. Actually, I was telling up when um, you were handing over. You were telling her, refilling her that, hey, mama, this is your car. I don't want to see you in motorbikes and bikes anymore. Oh, my goodness. I was like, oh, my goodness. This is what we want. This is progress. Who doesn't want to cheer this girl up? I wanted to be there and give you a big huge hug of what you have done to your mother and I know that car is your mother but I know your dad is so proud your dad is gonna be proud of you uh, dear sister your entire family is going to enjoy the car and I, I pray for you because our people back where we come from they are enemy of progress most of them are enemy of progress they don't want to see people shining they don't they don't want to see hard-working people but I pray and I protect you by the blood of Jesus Christ is going to protect your family It's going to secure your family your mother is going to be protected her car is gonna shine and more cars I uh, the doors are opening for you guys and the way you were holding your sister's hand your elder sister she's so beautiful keep holding her hand keep supporting her oh my goodness bring your brother together you guys be hook, hang yourself you know hook yourself like gum hold yourself 
hands. Don't let people bring hatred on, or, or people just trying to destroy your family or trying to say, oh, this brother say this, this sister say this, this this mother say this. No, hold your family. You are a family. Be together, enjoy together, build the nation together, support the communities together. You guys, you are shining. If you don't know, people are not happy for you. But I'm here as Umoto Lifestyle to tell you, keep shining and keep going. And I like that your mother prays all the time. I am myself, I'm a seven day Adventist. I know seven day Adventists, how we pray and how we breathe. But I'm here to tell you, congratulations, D. Mwango. You have done African Queens well, me as an African Queen lady, you have done as well. You have shown a good example for us and you have shown people that actually YouTube can work. YouTube works if you put more effort. Like for me, I have a YouTube channel. My name is Umoto Lifestyle, but I have a full-time job. That's why I don't upload so much. <laughs> but I was so proud to see our sister, our little sister, prosper and gifting her mother, you know, a dream dream of little girl, you know, give to her mother a car. Oh my goodness, if you are a hater, shame on you. Go support that little girl, her dear Mongo. In, instead of hating, call her, write her, ask her how she does a thing, okay? And more is coming. Oh well guys, Asumoto Lifestyle, I was here just to give a shout out to our sister and a shout out to our family who works hard and who deserves a credit. Guys, from my backyard to you guys, I'll see you in the next one.